What's up, guys? Welcome back to That Chick Angel TV. It's me, Angel. First, before I start this vlog, let me say a very special thank you to Experian for sponsoring this vlog. As you all notice, I am standing in the Twins Nursery. That's why you see Kai inside. The reason why I'm standing in here is because this room will be no longer here soon. Because me and my husband finally refinanced our home. Yes! Our family has expanded like beyond my belief. We had the twin boys, so now we have three boys total. And then we moved my niece out here from Kentucky who was helping us with the twins. So we went from being a family of three to a family of six. So we are about to do some renovations and some things to change this house up to make it more conducive to having a family sit of six in the house. So this nursery will be moved to a different part of the house and this area will be turned into a second bathroom because we only have one bathroom. So before I get into some of the things that we did um, to make refinancing possible, I'm gonna take you all to the sunroom where the major renovation will be done. Okay, so now I am in my sunroom and I'm pretty sure you're like, what in the world is this? <laughs> this is actually a partition wall that we had to put up because the nursery used to be my large closet and get dressed and put on makeup room but then when the babies got here that all got snatched away from me so our rather large sunroom became part my closet slash my office part storage part uh an area for my son and my husband to play video games but once we start renovation, the sunroom will become an actual add-on to the house. So we'll make part of it a larger nursery for the twins so that when they get a little bit older, it won't be too cramped for them. And the other part, a um, den slash playroom for the boys. And as I said before, the nursery, the now nursery will become an additional bathroom as well as a closet for more. I'm so excited about that. <laughs> so I want to talk to you all about this process of me and my husband refinancing our home. Um, for those of you all who have gone through buying a home or refinancing a home, it can be a daunting process. It can be kind of like, oh my goodness, what is happening? And I feel like my husband and I took some precautions or did some things that made it, I feel like, easier on us. One of those things that we did was we developed healthy financial habits long before we decided to refinance our home. We wanted to make sure that any actions we were taking when it concerned money were having a positive and not a negative effect on our FICO credit score. So for instance, we knew that having too many credit cards with high balances could potentially negatively affect our FICO credit score. So we made sure we kept our balances paid down so that we could hopefully secure a lower interest rate. Another huge, huge, huge thing that I think sometimes people take for granted uh, that we made sure we did was we paid our bills on time. It didn't matter what it was. We made sure if it was due on the 25th, it was going to be paid on the 25th or before. Another thing me and my husband did was we monitored our FICO credit score. Sometimes you don't want to look at it if it's not as high as you want it to be. And you're just like, I just want to kind of ignore it. But no, if you monitor it, you can find out if what you're doing is going to have a good effect or a bad effect on your score. So we kept monitoring it and we were able to see when we were doing things that were positively affecting it, which is what we wanted. And we were able to see when we were making decisions that probably weren't in our best interest. And we were able to, you know, correct ourselves and move in the right direction. So these are some of the things that we did to make refinancing our home and starting the construction or reconstruction of our home possible. So again, I wanna say a very special thank you to Experian for all this information and knowledge to help me move forward financially with my life. If you too want more of this information, feel free to click the link below or just go to www.experian.com forward slash education. And if you have any tips on what we should do with our sunroom, we've got a lot of space, people. Leave the suggestions below. I can't wait to take you on this journey with us. All right. Thanks for watching and be blessed. Did you have something else you want to say? <laughs>
Do you do? You tell them, hey. Show them your tooth. Hold on, let's see if it'll come in. Show them your tooth. 